Hey everyone, Luke Shelton out here at the Maroon Activity Center where tonight the Butte Central boys and girls renew the rivalry with Anaconda. It's Mining City versus Smelter City, so let's get to those highlights. Number three, Aiden Luster. Girls on deck first. Central earned its first win last week. Anaconda undefeated in conference play, but their top scorer, McKenna Patrick, out for the season with an ACL and MCL tear. The Copperheads need someone to step up tonight, and how about the 5'11 junior, Manaya Lunsford, who hits the short bank shot to put Anaconda up by six. Now Molly Drew takes the pass from Macy Anderson and she'll knock it in as the Maroons cut into the lead. But Lunsford piling up the points tonight as she drills a long two to make it an eight point game. And Lunsford just zeroed in as she hits another long two to keep Anaconda on top. But the Maroons have a weapon of their own and Brooke Batavinik who pulls up, sinks a three pointer and the latest member of Central's thousand point club adding to her legacy. A hard fought battle but the Copperheads pull away for a 49-42 win. Now on to the boys game and how's that for a sight as the Maroons un unveiled their state championship banner. And the defending champs looking every bit the part tonight is Dougie Peoples, and he knows a thing or two about the long ball as the Maroons strike first. Fast forward and there's Jack Keeley with a nice left-hander and Central suddenly on top 14-0. Now here's Eric Los draining the fadeaway and now it's a 16-3 game. Los, back-to-back -back buckets and one word folks, blowout. Final score Central 73, Anaconda 28. In Butte, Luke Shelton, MTN Sports.